بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم ویلکم ٹو ندر ویڈیو آن اوریکل ایپیکس اینڈ ٹوڈے وی آر گوئنگ ٹو کور اباؤٹ لک اینڈ فیل بیکاز دس از نارملی ریکوائرمنٹ دیٹ ایوری کمپنی دے نیڈ دیئر اون لک اینڈ فیل اور ایون ڈیولپرز دے نیڈ ٹو امپروو دیئر لک اینڈ فیل اینڈ سم ٹائمس دے ڈونٹ نو ہاؤ ٹو ڈو دیٹ اینڈ ان یونیورسل تھیمس اوریکل ایپیکس ٹیم ہیز پرووائڈیڈ built in um, classes and all those things which you can just use you don't need to write any code or anything just copy paste and things will change or will improve you can change the colors you can change the background you can change the uh, text color buttons you can create your new buttons you can uh, give icons to your buttons or you know in, at different places so now if uh, certain requirements are there from where to start from where to I mean, explore things uh, or how we can do that one or in Oracle Apex where we can implement these changes, so, right? So in this video, we are going to discuss about uh, these things, especially uh, universal theme and we'll see how we can improve our look and feel. Then you can, you know, uh, decide the way you want or uh, the level of uh, um, improvements or uh, look and feel you want, you can proceed with that, right? So, I have logged in in my apex.oracle.com account and I have installed this application uh, which is uh, related to this uh, theme, universal theme and you can find it in the gallery, let me show you this one, right, or you can google as well because there is online uh, version as well. So I am just running it. It has all the details the way you can um, improve your look and feel using uh, CSS classes. So if you see here, uh, you have this uh, design site where you can get some details. Then you have uh, here the reference over here. So if I go directly to the color and status modifier, then we'll discuss about buttons as well. So colors and status modifiers this is block text background so if we will use this one it will change only the background not the foreground or the text and it is just for the border right so let me take one example if i can take let me create one page demo okay I will add one region then one page item I'm not just renaming it I just uh, you can create button below I need to create a button right so this is button this is this one save let me first show you by default how they will look like okay uh, because this is uh, not having login page so I need to make it public public okay run and now it should display me this one okay now so now this is normal without any changes yes you can make changes using this property there are certain changes but i am not explaining this area or the properties today we are going to discuss about using this uh, option right so let's say for example this is uh, my block and this is the background so let me take this background if i take this one copy and say my this is my text box and let me come down CSS class so let me put it over here okay so if you see here this color I just applied in the background of this text box right just paste it here 
okay now for the colors if you can take this one you can just apply this color or just border up to you and this is for the block size and if you see down there are multiple so these are dark colors straightforward color utilities you can use them then you have the opacity as you like right so next is let's say for example i have buttons i have this button let's say i have uh, classic report and i have added buttons over there if you see here just click i because of the link it will take you to the reference uh, page here yeah, see the button builder you can come to the reference then button builder right okay so now this is the current one here as per the settings so let's say for example if i need with icon you can just click this one just icon this one right and it is changing this link text and this link attributes i will show you where you can change this one now if you want to make more changes let's say let's say we want to make it primary the color is changed danger it is red and simple default as you like and there are certain advanced settings as well so once you are comfortable with that and you can see over here then you have to copy this link text and this attributes now i will show you how copy and here i have this uh, button i think let me button i think this one yeah because this is my just just i created one classic report and just added one column as a blank or null as a link and then i will come to the columns and link then here if you see this is my link and and you have to change the type to the link right then you have here the link where i just uh, made it page 6100 which is the pages reference and then here you have to copy so let's say for example i will just remove it link text so whatever is here i'm just copying here and pasting over here okay and let me remove this as well just to show you how it will work okay that's it right now once you will run uh, Okay, it will change that page, but no problem. We will make it again back to the main side. Okay, see the, the button got changed. So it is as per your color scheme or you know your uh, standards. Uh, this might be not right for this page, but I'm just showing you how you can change that one. Right? Okay. Normally, for example, if you are creating a button and you need icon here right you have to assign an icon and you don't know what to assign or how to assign or what is the name of the icon you can come on this and just click on these icons right so let me take let's say for example this one even here you can change the settings see the size large etc so this is the icon name right copy and here paste save then run see here it is not looking nice because this color combination is not fine for this so let's see how it is let me remove this and no. Okay. Now here it is. So if you want to spin it as well, it is static. Spin. No, it will it is spinning. And now I will take this one. Control C. And I can control V. Okay. I just refresh it over here. So now this should spin. Okay, 
so there are many icons you can change their settings and then you can copy the icon name from here and these are so many these are AI icons okay wow so many and very easy you know you can see here as well you can play with their you know look and feel and you can assign over there uh, same way you can come over here with different options you can explore further the things you are trying to do or you want to do right at the same time you can use this uh, customize uh, roller which we are not covering today at least because my objective is today to just give an orientation about uh, universal theme references and how you can use them in your application right so here you can use your roller to change the look and feel of your application right uh, in next I am going to discuss about the CSS uh, this was just uh, things which you can use in the properties and CSS and all those things then we will use um, Chrome and we will see how we can find classes and then we can how we can tweak them or we can change them the colors and all those things right so stay tuned share your feedback thank you very much and Allah Hafiz